What is going on, JRD Nation? Brandon Epstein here from the Jump Rope Dudes, and I want to discuss Joe Rogan's recent podcast episode with Brian Grazer, where they talked about jump rope, just and they talked about the different benefits of jump rope. Brian talked about his personal experience, his story with jump rope, and then Joe talked about all the benefits he's got from it. So we thought it'd be fun to break down this conversation. Given that we are a jump rope channel, we love the Joe Rogan podcast, so it's just all the things we love here at once at the same time. So before I get into actually discussing this and breaking down their discussion, I want to shout out our boy Rushy. He's actually someone who already created a video reacting to this, discussing it, and I'm going to echo some of the things that he said on his show, which was that this is exciting. We see Jump Rope beginning to make its way into the mainstream. We start to see more and more people accepting it as an incredible way to lose weight, create the body you want, and just enjoy your workout. So awesome super pumped on that rushy jump rope dudes we're on the same page so i'm just gonna watch some clips with you and then i'll just respond back to them and and tell you know kind of tell you my opinion on it so let's get started we're gonna start with just a little bit of brian's experience um when he was talking to joe about how he got into jump rope so right before this clip started he was talking about how he had you know a girlfriend and she was giving him a hard time and so he started jump rope so i'll, I'll play from there it wasn't fat in the in that really you fix it with shame i fix it with shame she shamed me uh. and i started jumping rope uh -huh. and i started with i do all everything with uh, an achievable goal i just did a couple minutes and i just kept going and then pretty soon uh, you know i did the rope with the uh that had a counter all right, so i'll right? pause it right there that's a huge point that brian just made is that when you start jumping rope, you don't want to just start with full length workouts if you've never done it before. Of course, your your form is going to be poor, so you're going to be messing up a lot, and so you're going to be defeated, and you're not going to have great form, so you're going to have to work on that form first. So when he said he started with a couple minutes a day, that's the same thing we talk about on this channel, right? And it worked out really well for him. He lost a bunch of weight. He really enjoyed it. And so we say the same thing. Start with five minutes a day jumping rope, and we actually have a playlist. I'll link it up here. Um, which will actually take you through the beginner steps of jumping rope if you're not already into jumping rope. Okay, let's hit pot. Let's hit play. That had a counter on it with mm -hmm. those plastic beads that gives a little weight on the, and a and a nylon rope, a mm -hmm. nylon cord, and you could really wha get it going. So yeah. I could do 200 beats a minute for 30 minutes, and you're holding your body very tight. So it actually, I didn't think of it that way, but it cr really strengthens. Strengthened my core. So that's huge, right? So I'm gonna interrupt Brian again by saying, so he's using a beaded rope and he got some weight from it. The The great thing that we always talk about is that you, there's actually a lot of weights you can work into your jump rope workouts to make it um, really a whole fitness system. So we use the cross rope, I'll link it up in the description below, but we have weights from quarter pound to half pound to one pound to two pound to three pound to four pound to five pound if you wanna get really crazy. So adding in weights will help and they also do help you uh, with that core strength, which he was talking about because when you use proper jump rope form, you're keeping your core super tight. All right, let them continue now. Jumping rope is amazing. Yeah, so yeah. you obviously do. Yeah, it's do great. Joe jumps rope. Let's see. Let's hear what he has to say about it. Do you do it to only footwork. to warm up or mostly? Yeah, yeah. I just oh, do it footwork. to kind of get going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But for boxers, that's why the boxers use it so much. Yeah, and this is something we talk about all the time. A lot of times, boxers, along with Joe Rogan, they use jump rope more for a warm up or for like deep, longer conditioning sets. So it's just different tools. And so let's hear what they say from here and hear about some of the benefits. I mean, it's yeah. a, it's a staple of boxing workouts. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you're always on your toes, you yeah. know, so it's, it, it keeps your calves conditioned. All right, so he's about, he's saying you're always on your toes in your jump rope, which is true. You know, we talk about hopping in between the balls of your feet and your toes. So that's a huge part of proper jump rope form. Let's see where he goes from there. Ooh. Helps your, your body ability to, sh you know, yes. shift movement. Yeah. I mean, strong calves and strong feet are very, very important for, for boxing and anything that yeah. requires movement. Football players, a lot of football players use yeah. jump rope mm. to help their ability to move side to side and help their mobility. Yeah. 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 So it's huge. We talk about this all the time, but jump rope is really good for improving agility, being able to change direction and also, yeah, building those muscles in your feet, which is why some people say to us, I just started jumping rope. I've been doing it for three weeks straight and my feet are so sore because those are new muscles that don't usually get utilized. And when you do jump rope, you're activating those muscles. So that soreness goes away over time. So if you're new to jump rope and you're experiencing that, don't worry. Uh, your muscles gain strength in your feet and that uh, pain goes away. Great workout too, just great cardiovascular. Mm. 
Yeah. I, 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 it's very trendy right now, too. Is it? Yes. Another trendy yes. thing. Yes, another trendy thing. Yeah, the antidote to uh, fat shaming, Well, right? there's a lot of videos online uh, where uh, people are doing like these YouTube workouts of uh, jumping rope. All right, I'm pretty sure Joe's talking about us, or at least, you know, us, or Rushy, or a couple, someone out there in the community. We make a ton of workouts using uh, weighted ropes. So I'll, I'll link some of the play, one of the playlists up here that has our weighted rope workouts. And I think that's what Joe's talking about. And so that's awesome that he thinks jump rope is trending. We want it to be trending because it's just a fun way to move your body. We want to get it out to more people. Um, so I'll let them continue from here. And then they also have weighted ropes, which is makes it more I intense. used a weighted rope too. Yeah. I, I used to go everywhere with the, these ropes. So if yeah. I were in an airport, I'd be doing it. I remember being on a tarmac in Greece in Athens waiting and I was doing it. I would do it on in the rain. Uh, I would do all, all, I always, did, every day I did it. Yeah, that's a huge thing uh, that people appreciate about jumping rope is that you're basically bringing your whole gym anywhere you go with you. So you can do it on, like he said, a, a tarmac at an airport or you could do it in a, uh, a hotel gym or you could do it in a parking lot or you could do it on a rooftop or you can even do it in your hotel room if you have enough room you can really kind of just do it anywhere where you have enough room above you for the rope to spin that That's i awesome. did with no fa without fail for uh, almost 12 years amazing so he was doing it for 12 years straight which is why he got such consistent results because as we always talk about here at the jump rope dudes it's all about consistency all right so i don't want to be dead horse but some, some highlights they talked about was jumping rope being really good for cardiovascular, for helping with agility, for helping, especially anyone who's doing boxing, martial arts, it's great for all those people. And like Brian said, you know, you only have to do it 30 minutes a day to get some pretty incredible results. So if you want to check out the weighted ropes they talked about, or it's probably, I don't know what weighted ropes they talked about that we talk about, they did mention weighted ropes. They're linked up in the description below. You can use our code do the thing at checkout to pick those up. And uh, yeah, I'd love to hear from you guys. If you had an opportunity to check out this episode and your thoughts on it, please let us know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the YouTube channel. We'll catch you in the next one.